everyone, it is in fact my birthday today and I am 29 going on 92 because I'm spending it at the garden centre. I'm going to go and buy a load of new plants for the front garden and then I'm going to literally plant them all when I get back, do a bit of gardening and just film a whole gardening video for you guys. So I'll meet my friend in a minute at the local garden centre, it's only five minutes away. And I'm just going to get loads of bright coloured things, all perennials so they last, they flower each year. I know nothing about gardening, I'm just pretending I do. But I'm going to get those and then, yeah, get gardening. So I thought I'd give you a quick little tour of the garden centre and just some of the plants and flowers in there. They were absolutely beautiful. There was literally so many to choose from. I was literally in my element. We also had some birthday lunch in the cafe, which was banging. But anyway, this is my trolley and this is everything that I picked up. I also got some compost as well, but that's obviously not in the trolley. And then here I am back at home and this is how I've just laid it all out. I do play around with it, although it doesn't stay like this. I play around with the colours and where I want things to go. The weather is bloody glorious and as you can see the dogs are thoroughly enjoying the sun. That is actually the tortoise hut because I've woken the tortoise up. He's in the garden enjoying a bit of sun which actually there he is. I can see him there. Let's show you the tortoise. Good boy Cozzy. Hello Thomas. Oh and a cat. How lovely it is. <coughs> Tommy's oh Enjoying that, darling. Right now, it's time to get the gardening gloves on and get planting all these lovely plants. I'm driving, you're smiling, just really. As you can see I started off with a delicate elegant little shovel thing and then I thought right sod this we're not getting anywhere so I had to get the big bad boy out. I'll let you know any gardening tips that I know. So basically one is that you should group colours together. I thought you could sort of dot all the colours around, multicoloured, but apparently it's better to have like groups of colour. And when you're planting all your new plants, on average you need to dig a hole that's twice the size of the pot it's in so that the roots can grow and everything and dig deep enough so that it can then sit in comfortably and then you put compost all around the middle of the bit that you've dug, then the plant, then more compost on top around the edges. Just 
Now this flower that I'm holding here is probably my favourite one and that is called a camellia and it's a white camellia and it is absolutely gorgeous. My planting out here is officially all done and as you can see I've got some left over so I'm going to pot these up and put them in the back garden just to add a bit of colour to the back. And this is the final result out the front and I'm absolutely buzzing with this, I think it looks so so pretty and colourful. The next job is to sort these little bushes out that aren't actually really bushy anymore because they got it all eaten by caterpillar moth. So I'm going to try and revive these little bushes and get all the weeds out. I'm going to treat all the bushes with special stuff that gets rid of the caterpillars and then I'm going to lay this landscape bark down in between them all so they just look better shape again and just without all the weeds. Here's a close up of how good it's looking, it's looking so much better like this, I just literally need to do the whole lot now.
Bulbs. I'm now going to put up all the spare plants that I didn't need to use and get the back looking glorious as well. I know that I haven't been who I was. I am supposed to be the one you can try. I feel so useless cause I let you down I hope there's some way I can make it alright Cause I know that you deserve much more than this If you give me one more chance I swear I'll try my best to always be there And I Selfish and made you believe that you're not good enough, but you're all I need. I take you places that you've never been. I would give you the world if you let me try again. Yeah, just give me one more chance. I swear I'll try my best to always be there. And I
The final thing we're doing is a bit of weeding. But thank you so much for watching this video. Hope you've enjoyed it. And I hope it's going to give you some motivation to get in your garden and get it looking all lovely for spring and summer 2024. As always, please do subscribe to my channel as it really helps. And I look forward to seeing you next time. Bye!